All right, we are back once again. And we are above 110,000. So we're going to try and stream a little bit. The city is obviously taxing my computer. I have reduced the amounts of assets. So I think uh, we should be, I don't know, maybe good for a little while. Game runs fine when it's, uh, they don't have any anything going on. So I thought I would come into this area and kind of, we had been working on this a bit. I just wanted to get my monitoring up. I'm going to fill in this 70s subdivision with some trees because, you know, we like trees. And it's really... We've gone through a lot of... I've gone through a lot of areas and obviously made them pretty plausible. That has, those houses abandoned themselves because... They had nothing. <clears throat> so we're kind of going around. We've got we've got some more some more demand for commercial for residential, and we have uh, industrial demand. So what I'd like to do is kind of look at this demand here. Some of this is kind of kind of junky. Be a better better industrialized commercial zone, I think. Probably mix in some other stuff with it. This is one of those areas we kinda we kinda set up for uh for, for testing growth and stuff like that, so it, it seems to to have worked well. Not sure how f far we're going to be able to take this city, and we might we may just end up doing recordings of it. It is uh, taxing this my system when I stream, so there's that. Oh. Oh, no problem. I was I was trying to stream this morning, and uh, I kept running out of memory. My CPU is maxed, but uh, while I'm here, I'll show you a couple of things. We're at 110,000 people. I've been dressing up the runways. Added some, re some residential here. Finish this residential and industrial along this way. Might poke something in here, but that'll kind of take care of it this way. And eventually play more with the prison. I spent probably a few hours redoing the uh, fishing port area. And... So what I did is I got more assets for detailing stuff. But when we're close in, it looks really good. I did get the first person camera. So I did do some, uh, I did do some recording of driving. So I'll probably try and do some videos like that. And we really went in here and tried to do some nice details. Hopefully that looks pretty good. Getting a save. Auto save during stream is probably bad. But uh, at least it, it saves us every 10 minutes or so. And maybe it's something I can't do. <clears throat> Looks like we have to wait a second. You know, if, if I had a better graphics card, it would look better. Uh, 
I think I'm going to turn that idle save off. Oh, maybe, maybe that's a bad idea. Oh, I'm kind of tired of that. And I can't, uh, I can't justify spending the money on RAM and stuff, new stuff, so. Well, I think, I think I might just restart the game. Let's just do that. It'll just take a second. Kind of, uh, very frustrating. It probably won't take long. Hey, David, we're 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 here, so don't don't run away. I'll put the uh, music. I'll put the music screen on for a minute. Don't forget to like the stream because you know obviously that's nice. We're almost to one twenty. Got three to go on that. Yeah, I do have the ultimate eye candy in. Well, the next the next times I'll stream will probably just be with uh, uh, Riverton. That'll be Sunday for sure. We're just reloading the game. I guess I guess this will be the chat this the channel uh, channel theme. To make us I have to make a screen that says reloading game. Look at that. They were back. Yeah, I have ultimate eye candy. Let's turn off auto save right away options. Because that could just, you know, that could be, that could be the thing that's happening. I can save the game, no problem. And we're fine. I changed the coloring a little bit. Yeah, so there we, there we are. I was showing... The dock area. You know, actually one of my favorite little parts right now are this just this little just this little corner. Kinda kinda nice. We are getting some places that there may be too com too much commercial. So we could go in here. And we could destroy some of these and put houses. I wanted it to look nice. We could come back through here and put some houses. They got more stuff. That's probably the problem. Let's see. Gotta give that that kind of a look to everything. I did get a few different. There. there. And then that 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 helps some of our house issues too, probably. We we will we'll adapt our neighborhoods as they are as they are needed. And I've been working uh, downtown a little bit, so I'm trying to. Trying to really give this a different, a better look to it. I like this block of stuff. I didn't do much. 
but uh, the downtown just, just not what I really liked. I added some housing here, bike paths all around. We get a, a little flooding here every time we start, but no big deal. Then we've got some of the railroad stuff here. Trying to little by little give it more industrial look. Just adding the trees, trees, adding trees are uh, a significant improvement. I'll put some random trees at the, uh, just to, uh, you know, so it lessens some of the noises in the area. But I ever get to the point where I can justify getting a, a, a different motherboard with more RAM, well, and a GPU, GPU, but uh, I can't. I spent the $2,500 on tools earlier in the year, so I can't justify the uh, <laughs> motherboards and stuff like that. So, yeah, so. This area really did take off nicely. I had gotten these these rocks and stuff. I thought that would look nice in areas. Got fishing happening, so we're we're all good. You want candy? I don't have any candy. So hopefully they'll 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 ha satisfy themselves with workers. Uh, the zoo still seems to be operating pretty well. I think. Does anyone come to the zoo? Oh uh, yeah, we, we are getting zoo people. What I wanted to do is try and justify some of our... Yeah, you know, the computer that I got... I'll go on to the internet and I'll show you. And you can get these at Walmart. Actually, you one you can get at Walmart right now, possibly, is the Ryzen Five version, and that's actually the I have a Ryzen. I have this version that I use for my driving simulator, and I added more RAM to it. But not a big game, a big builder, and this. Just the just the computer with eight with sixteen is roughly around eight hundred dollars. So it's not cheap, but it's uh, a lot cheaper than what they're trying to sell you as, as gaming gaming builds. So I will be making some visual enhancements to the airport, but I won't do that on screen so much. Running these runway markings and stuff like that. It's tedious. And if something crashes, I'm not gonna, it's no fun. Yeah, it, the, the, the HP ones are, are perfectly fine. I have I have four of them. There's, I bought the boys two. And I bought myself two. Not all in one, one day, but so I did go through here before it crashed. Got rid of some of this. Thank you. Hopefully it'll get better. Hopefully it will get better. So let's just. Touch on trade on making this. I think the next thing we need to do is run, is to make a, uh, I don't want to make a wilderness park.
I also enjoy getting our population. Pretty good demand on everything, so we're kind of going up there in the population. I just got to bring up my window with. Yeah, our memory is up, up high again, but I think it, I think it tends to settle down. I'd like to go and copy some of the factories, but I don't know if that's necessarily <laughs> what we need to do. I'm going to go into Rico. Gotta do some of these office buildings like this. I'd like to kind of make this entire area look like one big factory. It's all all for industrial, but then it then it all looks like a At some point, we'll probably play with Rico. Uh, not Rico, but I don't know what that's. You can you can adjust everything. I forgot what it's called. Good old factories were. brick and stuff like that so it really gives that high area and we need a lot of workers here again so that's that's the other thing one two run this road out towards here And we're going to put some residential in there. The demand, demand being up is, is good for us. We go here. Put these small additional buildings here. They tend to look good with all this. Very small compared to everything else. And as always, if we're Mildly enjoying the stream. Please smash the like button. I know some people have. I'm try and give this the look of old factories. Will it be perfect? You know, it probably won't. We'll try. We'll kind of move these together. It'll just look better than just a whole bunch of the uh, regular factory industries. Hopefully it'll satisfy some of our industrial need then. Definitely got to come through and put like 
pipes. Stuff like that. And we can also if we do it as we do these things. We bring these and we can move them into stuff. And give our factories extra smokestacks and stuff like that. All we're trying to do is trying to give it a, a different look. And you can zone and get that kind of stuff by putting those one one by one squares. So at this time, it's probably time to save the game. If we do it manually, we're okay. So yeah, that looks uh, that looks pretty good. And we'll probably take this guy out of here. Unzone that. Okay. There we go. Of course, we're going to need some warehouse. into here we have our big distribution center things and they can go on they can go on an angle that doesn't hurt anything. yeah I, I think auto save might just be like crazy in here some parts of this we have to work in a certain way so that the game just works right and then others we just do other things this is going to be uh, commercial goods so we can throw commercial goods into here not oil industry I always bring commercial goods in here. And we can come in here and get truck. Oh, you know, you know, what are these? These are elevated structures of some sort. What is these? But whatever they are, they look good. It's just those must be docks. Those are railroad stuff. So we want trailer. That's what we need to actually probably make the mobile home park. And again, I think I mentioned, well, I didn't mention because I crashed on that. Uh, we only have some of these trailers, but they can work. We can make a kind of a, they're all target, but I don't think anyone will care. We have some Walmart ones too. See if we can get semi tractor. Semi, what's that? Semi conductor plant. I think we put that someplace else. What I need is the cab, and I know that there's some place. I know that. I, know that. But I guess we're not going to get a get a prop.
Nope, don't have it. I, okay, I hope you guys are okay with that. So let's put some fence in. We don't need prison fence. We do have chain link fence. Well, that's pretty good around the factory. Gives us just a little bit of a uh, credibility. That's a secure, secure building facility. Right on the sidewalk. Those around there. So it looks, you know, it, you got good capacity probably coming out of here, so it looks better than a, a regular type of situation. We have no students attending college. We should probably, I should probably figure that out. What's going on with that? Yeah, it gives us a little bit of reality, right? Now we have these big open spaces. You know, what do we do with that? We take, uh, I don't know why we do that. Find something industrial. Yeah, <laughs> but it looks, well, that would be, that looks pretty good there. I think that does the trick. We certainly need something to fill in this area. Yeah, those guys probably need some place to Yeah, that's the yard. We can do that. We can be. We can do that. Hey, Rick. What's going on? You know, even if we just. We can fill in some of that. Just so it looks. Just something different. I, I, I am cutting stuff on my laser, so I just gotta go check on it. I'm back. Right, actually. Yeah, so that looks uh looks better than it did. Same thing here, I did a small factory area here. Quite a, quite a few. Let's do something here. Bring this road out to here.
I don't really need you. Something like that. You could put a small factory in there. <clears throat> yeah, so that actually looks pretty good. Pretty happy. Yeah, we could actually uh, do this. It might be a lumber industry area thing, but uh, I don't care. And what we would do. We'll do a little industrial zoning here, right? Yeah. Just so we can bring in some other stuff. There. That'll be good. Yeah, you can put those different zonings right, you know, in the middle of your city and it can be good now and there are there are some assets and stuff that don't show uh, like kind of invisible invisible stuff I don't really need I'm gonna put this here sometimes you don't want to actually have one of those plantations they do have a different kind of plantation stuff. So hopefully no one's going to care that that's there. I'm okay with it. And that, that will produce, that'll give us the look of, eventually they'll start bringing lumber in there. And that's, that'll be that. I think we could, uh, yeah, that's perfectly fine. Gives us a little industrial capacity. There are a lot of, a lot of pine trees around. It's a very tree friendly industrial area. Uh, yeah, that's good. I, I like that. Look, okay, we got good demand. We'll see what happens. Happens. With that. I need to put some trucks or something. That's storage. Probably we want to have a warehouse here. What tree? That's a uh, tree. Is that is a leafy, leafy tree. No. London plane tree from Mr. Mason's collections. Is that one of the ones that came with the game? So let's go over here. Yeah, I got a lumber yard too. Yeah, maybe we can. That can all be part of that. We can all have fun in there. And if we were, we were smart, we'll take this road and we'll take this factory. This factory almost looks like it. Set this to plain timber. How's that sound? Very good. I like it.
bring back this room. Not that road. That road. There. And it all kinds of... Essentially kind of blends in a little bit. Got some oil industry stuff here, but you're going to probably have to re... <laughs> More trees. Well, trees are nice because they do grow back. Oh, I did uh, rebuild the viaduct here. They did that. And I, I thought I did that one, but maybe, maybe that was right before. Oh, no, I did this one. Tried to work on it. Yeah, we, we did that one. Made it nice. Traffic's at 70, so pretty good. You know, there's some, some hot spots in the area, but uh, okay. Some places are just going to be busy. I will save often. Yeah, I think, you know, I think like these areas, I think they're done. You know, I might want to come back and play with a tweak. This area we can play with a little bit. I did set up the military base area, so we do have that. Too. <clears throat> but I think this general area right here is uh, is complete. So we don't have to go into there. Everything else we do, which, you know, obviously I don't think we're going to get anywhere too bad to there. To that area. Who knows? We will. We got plenty of ways to go, so if we can keep keep the city going, we'll 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 keep going on it. Unless we get bored and we think we need to make a new one. But once you get to that that point, you kinda want it to, to keep going. Again, this is one of those areas we just kind of really just filled in. And this is mostly uh, commercial. Oh, yes, I think I know. I'm going to come along here. Yeah, we're going to find all residential. Uh, well, we use them as con they're condos, but we're not really using them as condos in a way. Kind of semi apartments. Don't let David know that I might have uh, placed some buildings in the trees. I think if we can maintain our population growth and then kind of come back and say, oh, yeah, you know, we could we could do something different here. So we kind of are by the airport, so we don't we're not necessarily going to be super high. Parking. 
Maybe some of their parking is across the street, you know? It'll make them happy. It'll make us happy. Not a very well planned development. It's just like, let's get them buildings up. I kind of want it to make sense. Yeah. No, they don't need to cross this. This is not. This is not the kind of. So I'm thinking. We can do this. We can do two parking buildings like that. And then we can come in. And do this and this, right? Duplicate, duplicate that. They walk. These these Sims will walk like sixty-five miles, won't they? They're crazy. Right. We can do stuff like that. That kind of goes behind some of those buildings. And then we come back and click that. Click that. Click that. And that looks pretty good. <clears throat> yeah, they're crazy. And then we could probably do that again, can't we? Click. Click. Yeah. There. Well, that might be it for the, the big stuff. Come over here. Probably. Take a few of these out. Move these. Don't get all excited, people. You got your parking lots. Don't worry. Well, I think for a simulation, I think we did very good by them. They are. Probably should move some of the trees out of there. Some of them, anyway. And yeah, we can kind of... Come in here and fill in some of that. Maybe a little local commercial bodegas or something on the end. I say bodega because I'm, you know. Yeah, they're, they're, they got no problems here. Great. I think we'll come in here and grab this tree. Yeah. Got some highway blockage. All those trees. Yeah, bodegas kind of. We 
You can say bodega. I'm putting old stuff in here too. I could have a restaurant. Should probably get a couple of restaurants. Gotta get our couple little get our Chick Fil A down here. Have a booksellers. People are gonna come down here. And and they got Chips Hamburger Guy. Some people like Bob Evans. Down here. I'm gonna give him a jack in a box only because it fits. And the panda tickets. Maybe not. Maybe we don't get a panda express here. Maybe that's just what they get. That's all. So yeah, we're keeping our demise. I think Bob Evans is kind of like a cracker barrel kind of. All right. Still plenty of uh, industri industrial demand. And I think we're going to do this. Integrate a little bit more of this into our city. Since I believe this is going to be an oil area. Excuse me. We have a lot of oil industry. And we could be pumping out even more. So we're going to. Throw in a couple things into here. <laughs> yeah, that's big oil. Welcome to Texas. Or not. So we're probably going to end up building another type of uh, refining area. We're going to bring oil into here. Let's bring it into here. Kind of around like that. Go into our oil industry area. We can we can make stuff here. We have the uh, we have the tech now. They do not like. That. Always put these guys right next to those. Always need that. Uh, I have one over here. Right there, you not have one. 
There is uh, fire and stuff here, but I don't know if I got one in this general area. No. no. It doesn't have anything good here. So this would probably be a very good area right here. They have kind of a <coughs> services area. Got that big hospital too. But it doesn't seem to actually treat anybody. There. Kind of a little city services area. All that water we got flowing around here. These guys got. Leave that. This should be a, that, that's turning into be a very busy area. And they all die, right? Yes. I appreciate uh, everyone stopping by. We got a few likes. Always welcome to join into the conversation. Or you could just hang out and watch. Good with that too. Alright. That would uh eventually we'll get some oil there. And we're getting some traffic jams here, so we can go into the vanilla traffic jam. I don't think we need a light here. Let's make that a stop. Same thing here. It can be get a lot of silly stuff going on. I went around and did did do some of that before, so should, should open up some traffic. Look at these guys. Look at these guys. Oh my god. They're all going here now. <laughs> Guess they're gonna find the shortest shortest route. Alright, I wanna look at this. The cool thing is we have oil. Everywhere. So we don't really have a problem putting down oil rigs. Yeah, look, they're going crazy. So we can we can produce a lot of oil. Look at that demand. Look at that. We got people dying, but we got demand. So we can we can pump out oil like nothing. It also looks like we should probably have upgrades. What is that? At least in some areas. It's probably because there's a stop sign there. I don't really want to put that. So, how do we do this? Everyone's just going to go where they want. Yeah, let's, we're obviously going to have to bring some other road connections. Uh, I, I don't know if I do for sure. So 
we need to give them some better options so they don't all go there. But if we are feeding more oil in, so you put them. I knew we had tons of oil. We'll have to produce more also. Yeah. We'll be pumping out oil. I think they will. I hope they will. Yeah, we've got pretty good demand on some of that stuff. Commercial. Yeah, it looks like we got to throw a little power in here. Did break something. That should take care of that. So our oil industry should be very good. We'll see how that how that works out for itself. Let some of that work its way out. There. So yeah, what I ha what I did do, I'll do a little bit of this. <clears throat> I don't know where they're located. Ah, uh, one way road. So they're a, they're actually kind of a road network. Put anarchy on. You can run them like that. That's why they get a little tedious. They're not perfectly set up. Just, you know, if your road's not runway is not perfectly straight it's gonna kind of be weird look at, all the, look at all my silly planes but we can come back i think we do it around around the runway really well like that something like that like that Here, it's grabbing part of the nodes. I think go and take all that off. Do anarchy. Do that. So I'd have to, you know, I have to play with that. Come back and we get rid of we can come back and get rid of all this. Not perfect. And that that road network gives it a nice look to it. So obviously yeah, that's looking better. That's what I'm trying to do. Try to make it look better. I like the, the green the green stuff. We do have trucks of it. Oh, yeah. That's what we're going to get. Yeah. Truck. Prop. Fuel trucks. Nah, we don't put them in a line. Excuse me. 
I had a I had a good lunch. So yeah, that this is kind of what I wanted this to be. Uh, here. Pavement. Here. Prop. Trucks. There's a lot of fuel trucks here, you know. It fills it in nicely. And this is where they fill up. They come in here and they get gas. Look at that. Tree. I could actually make it look pretty, pretty realistic. Yeah. And then they can go right off into their, their little area. And refuel airplanes. Now, when I get a chance of, I can come in here and I can actually try to recolor those if I want. But we're. Oh, Looks like we're going to get a crash. <laughs> oh, if you heard me, that went well. 